another technical drawing solutions. I am DN Kamau. Today I'm going to take you through introduction to technical drawing part one. Here we are going to look at the importance of technical drawing. Technical drawing is a language, an engineer's language, where engineers from different countries can be able to communicate to each other. An engineer from China will be able to communicate effectively with an engineer from Kenya or any other country without speaking uh, in the same dialect. Here we can see a square of uh, a rectangle of 70 by 50. Yeah, an oval shape there. We have a triangle and so on. These shapes will remain the same no matter where you come from. So technical drawing is a very important, uh, it is a very important language that uh, brings the engineer, uh, engineers together. So the topics which we are going to look at include drawing instruments, use of the instruments, paper sizes, care and maintenance, drawing paper layout, printing numbers. What are the specific objectives. Objective number one is by the end of this submodule, the trainer trainee should be able to identify drawing instruments, use those instruments, take care and maintain uh, uh, care and maintenance of the drawing instruments, identify and generate paper sizes, identify different types of lines and their applications, layout of drawing paper, and G, print numbers and alphabets. So what is technical drawing or applied drawing? It is a formal and precise way of communicating information about shapes, sizes, features, precisions of physical objects. A graphical representation of objects and structures. A universal language of engineering used in design process for solving problems quickly and accurately. Visualizing objects and conducting analysis. It can be done using freehand mechanic, uh, mechanical or computer methods. General communication. Some of the communication methods include artistical drawings, sketches, skilled drawings, yeah, under which you can get site plans and engineering. So looking at the pictorial uh, uh, sketch that is, uh, that is given of a kitchen, you can be able to see how we can easily visualize everything that is in the mind and put it in the form of a drawing. Yeah. Here is a skilled drawing showing a plan of a building. 
this is drawn to scale and uh, the scale is reduced so that the building can fit in a small piece of paper. This is an engineering drawing where we have uh, an orthographic representation. We have a plan and a front elevation. These are some of the ways that engineering or uh, the drawing helps us to visualize things. As a designer, the most important thing is to get your ideas onto paper as quickly as possible. Sketching is therefore a very important skill to master. Drafting is probably the engineer's most important form of communication. Just as picture writing, the first form of written communication was used to express thoughts and records. So do engineers work with graphic mold intangible intangible ideas and theories into uh, the mold intangible ideas and theories into tangible goods and products engineering drawing is a graphic language that expresses and conveys ideas of shapes sizes size and construction of parts or mechanisms to have optimum value, engineering drawing must be clear, concise, and subject to but one interpretation. There's no other interpretation. Once it is a square, it is a square. If it is a rectangle, everybody will see it as a rectangle. Manual drafting, however, is slowly being replaced by CAD computer-aided design, i.e. computer-aided design. However, it is important for a trainee to acquire manual drafting techniques before moving on to CAD. Skilled drawing always emanates from sketches, which are normally a paper representation of human thoughts. Use and care of instruments. Since time is an important element in any industrial work, a clear understanding of all the drafting tools and drawing techniques is important to speed up the process of drawing preparation. The equipment, material, and instruments used by professionals, professional draftsmen, and engineers are described in this section. The choice of instrument should be such that the following is always upheld. Accuracy is very important. Speed, neatness, and good pencil work. Who uses technical drawing? Of course, everybody. We have researchers. We have vice presidents. We have students, we have computer operators, technical illustrators, managers. Everybody surely needs technical drawing. Everybody needs to draw. And these drawings help us to get things from theory into the physique, theory into practice. DN, thanks and welcome. Please subscribe.